As a hardship faced by many bites hard, Suko has come the way of Ewo community in Esan Central, local government area of Edo State. A non-governmental organization, Chris Oya Kilome Foundation, decides to feed 2,000 households as part of efforts to complement government's relief material initiatives. Impact on the on the livelihood of families. I mean, it's really so great. There are so many people that are facing hunger who have not been able to earn any kind of income during the lockdown. We've actually carried out emergency food response in all the six geopolitical zones of Nigeria. This is part of our commitment to working with the government in strengthening families and livelihoods of families that have been affected during this COVID-19 uh, restrictions. And today we are serving nine communities in Ewu. And in this project, we are supporting 2,000 households and we're providing wholesome palliatives for while receiving the donation on behalf of the Ewu Kingdom, the Honor J of Ewu is Royal Highness Abu Durazak Ojeofor Isesele III hailed the founders of the foundation, Pastor Chris Oyakilome, for the kind gesture. Pastor Chris Oyakilome is a son of Ewu. We are proud of him. We are happy with his, uh, his exploit in life. And uh, I wish him well. From the bottom of my heart, we are proud of him. I want to thank our, um, our dear man of God, Reverend Dr. Chris Oyakilome, for what has just taken place here at the palace. Now, what we are seeing today is actually an effect of what the COVID-19 had caused across the globe. I appreciate what he gave to us. I see God will give him long life and the ministry will continue increasing developing. Stop, Christ, it's time to God bless you. Give us food because we have been hungry because of this virus. So, we are satisfied now, we are grateful. 